It's blood. <laughs> it's blood and scorpions. It's blood and Medusa's head. that glowing mass? What are you hoarding so secretly? Nothing. It is nothing. Let me see it. Nothing. It is nothing. It is a sphere. It's mine. Let me see it. Don't touch it. It's fragile. An egg. How beautiful. Its leathery shell is beseeching me to wax its cracks. A crack? Where? You think your starling is inside this egg, but you are wrong. Have you seen the starling? Her plumage is a slick, hot mess of glossy green-black. She exudes a coal-tar slime trail wherever she goes. I wish to rub against her. Let us look inside. I want to climb inside it and wait there for wonderful things to happen. I have been inside this egg. What was it like? It was moist, like floating through a K-hole. The yellow more billowous than lemon drop, sticky as a sorrowful mauve. Piles of meaty flowers. All hair and teeth and bones were kissing and biting me. I punctured time like a wound. Liars. Liars. I have some news. I thought I was pregnant, but it is just a tumor. That is good news. There are many causes for celebration today. For everyone but me. I am sick, very sick, due to an encounter with Belladonna. I sucked on its fleshy rootstock and pale yellowing forms. Then I devoured the heady sweetness of the fermented berries. Blurred vision, staggering, headache, rash, flushing, dry mouth, slurred speech, urinary retention, constipation, confusion, hallucinations, delirium, and convulsions. We will eat your body when you are gone. We know you will taste amazing because of the way you look. Why did you do it? Why did you do it? That shiny girl living like a parasite inside me has expressed a wish to leave. I fell in love with her eyes once tiny black plums. I had to put them in my mouth. I swallowed the rest of her, too, intending for her to stay inside always. It is time for you to expel her. I will aid in the extraction. It will be called birth. You are making a mistake. It is better when they stay inside. I cannot believe I am a mother. I didn't know I was happy before. That was what happiness was before this. Look at this fat baby suckling me, robbing me of everything, nervous and slithery, a horrible monster, milky, soapy, sour in my mouth. It follows me around like bloated oats. She has rotten milk and vanilla. I see no end to this. You should probably kill yourself. I don't want her to leave, but she has already begun the descent. She will be a blind, pale creature. No, she will be colorful and full of mirth. I always hope for the best. Now you are outside of the body. How does it feel? It is like endless choking on heaping mounds of dirt and sugar. Now it is my turn to love her. Just look at her skin, glistening like a sumptuous holiday meat. She smells of pink pepper and tonka bean with a top note of bacon and a tiny breath of Egyptian geranium. She veers into a mouthy, aching sweetness she intoxicates me, a violent assault. If only you knew love like this, I puke champagne happiness. Mm -hmm. 